Come up that bunker you see there, high and lands nice softly. Four birdie attempts here at the par five. And it's amazing how you can tell by the sound of a shot nowadays, especially if you have some experience. People used to mock Johnny Miller when he would say, I could tell just by hearing the contact whether he got it a little bit high on the face or a little bit low on the face. And now as I've been in this broadcasting business for a few years now, we used to mock him, and now I'm going, you know what? He was right. Mm -hmm. I literally, like we heard that uh, Rory McIlroy, and I, you picked up on it as well. The sound of mm -hmm. his pitch shot, it sounded just a little bit, it had that higher pitched oh, click to it, which means if you caught it just a little bit low on the face, mm -hmm. the ball just, so you have more spin, and the ball tends to come out a little lower. He was trying to get the ball to fly a little bit deeper onto the green, into that upslope. And, uh, it, it really is uh, quite fascinating when you actually do this for a while and you have these amazing sounds and camera angles, what you can garnish knowledge-wise just by paying attention to it. Come on, Rory, you need to take advantage of this part five. And you'll be disappointed with that. Never fin I've finished outside the top ten. He's only played three times. Won this Canadian Open twice. And Pedro's caddy, you see there. Yeah, there you go. He's he's crouching in the bunker so he doesn't get in his eye line. He'll wait for the applause and he'll know that he's tapped in, then he'll pop.